Well, the beginnings of the Burnett School started with uh, interviewing PK for a position here at UCF, and he presented a concept that would allow UCF to become a player in the biomedical sciences arena. PK's vision for developing the Burnett School was to focus on a common theme of genetic basis of disease. The Burnett's had been a very great friend to the university, and the Burnett's were ready to do more. And I think they trusted Dr. Hitt to tell them that the maximum impact they could have was to help us build this facility for life sciences research. Once the university made the commitment to implement what I had proposed to them in 2002, then it is my job, working with my colleagues and all the others around, to make it happen. PK said to me uh, something that really struck a chord. He, he said, we're building something here. We started uh, recruiting more faculty members and he brought new ideas and a new um, direction. We've made great progress in establishing the facility, the Burnett uh, Biomolecular Sciences Building at Lake Nona, where our faculty can work, recruiting top faculty to work there, and now recruiting top students to work with those faculty. As an assistant professor, it's very unusual to come into something brand new and be able to, to have a voice and to, to be a part of building something. And I wanted to be a part of that. You have to have uh, a pioneering spirit to come to a place like UCF and watch the growth. It's quite exciting to come out and have brand new lab space, a uh, brand new office, and a building where you're going to have many new collaborators and colleagues as we hire top-rated scientists to join us. I had opportunities to go a number of places and saw a number of different universities and it was only at UCF that I saw this growth. We hire faculty members who are doing cutting-edge science. When you hire people who are self-motivated, and really hungry to achieve something, everything else will follow. When I checked his references, the most common comment I got from his references was that there's no one better than PK for recruiting and developing young scholars. And that's turned out to be absolutely true. 